Are I gonna be watching the Reign of Terror the last three episodes? Let's get on with it. I like the music. Here is the complete and detailed list of the recent executions, citizens. Even now, convention members are at work plotting my downfall. Do you think I want this carnage? We never did talk about it all, province. No, we didn't, did we? And I was so looking forward to it. Huh. I like the way the first doctor first. talks. Bring him with you tomorrow, Lamette. Yeah, we can't trust these a lot, the way they're just... the way they're acting. So worried, I thought I'd better bring her down here. Well, it's probably just a chill. Yes, but what if it's worse? There's a the lot of quick cuts. You must know someone we could trust. Yes, I think I do. I think I'd better go. Be careful, Leo. I will. We'll meet again, Barbara. And soon. What the hell? Now, let's just have a look at him. I wonder who he is. Ian. I think that's Ian. It's hard to tell who we know and who we don't, a little bit. Like, the main characters are obvious, but like, the side characters are kind of hard to tell if I've already met them. Robespierre is expecting you tomorrow. You must try and stay. He can have one of the soldiers' rooms. There's a man waiting to see you. I may have some information for you. I must be on my way. I have a long journey. Citizen! Oh. I must obey him. I'll stay then. But it was my duty to report it. You did well, citizen. Leon not here? No, he had to leave. He's arranging for Susan to see a doctor. T Ian! Barbara! Ian. Yeah, it is Ian. Uh, this is Jules. Not Jules Renan, by any chance. Yes? I've been looking for you. Look, you have a talk to Ian. Sounded like an order. Well, there is one question <laughs> I would like to ask you. Do you know a man called Webster? He asked me to contact a man called James Sterling. You say you don't know him? No. Sterling must be a spy. I suppose the chances of finding Sterling are pretty slim. We can try. Susan? I'm afraid he's getting worse. Oh. What even happened to her? I'm not sure. I'm not sure how she got ill. Maybe I'm just forgetting summer or I, I miss summer. I've got a feeling that it will be quite an eventful day. <laughs> yes, you appear to have a feverish chill, but it's nothing very serious. Yes, I'll treat her. I shall have to go out and collect some leeches. You... Barbara suspected us. Come on, let's go. It's locked. Oh, he locked it. I thought she locked it. Go with the physician. There they are. Well, I've got a feeling something's gone wrong, so don't worry. Take the girl to the cell. You're wanted for questioning. Citizen Lamert thought you might like to question this prisoner. <laughs> Doctor! My dear Bob! Oh. Leon, you must be Ian. Jules said you might be able to help. You walked right into my trap, didn't you, Ian? Huh. I like the cliffhangers. They're always cool. Never know who your friends are. You will cooperate, Ian. Well, now, we must find Chesterton and try and get back to the ship. My voice seems to carry some weight. Yes, it's rather impressive, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> he I does look cool. Out of the I've been loyal to the revolution from the beginning. Who sent you from England? How did you get here and who helped you? You wouldn't believe my story anyway. You let me be the judge of that. Is he going to tell him the actual really answer? I flew here with three friends in a small box. When I left England, it was 1963. Yeah, they're not going to believe that. All right, lay off! Release him! This way to seduce the enemy of the people. Barbara and Susan were arrested at the physician. Susan, Susan, it's, it's me, child. Oh, grandfather! If that door is opened, I lose my head. The mates, the mates, why can't you use your own initiative by now? <laughs> yeah, well, must... I'm just a humble servant. I demand you open that cell door. That door remains closed. Tonight, my men will be everywhere. Barras, your responsibility. But when we got to the prison, the doctor was there, dressed up as if he was running the revolution. <laughs> what I did, so I cool. That sounds like the doctor, all right. I don't know how he gets away with it half the time. What did he say? <laughs> I killed him. He was the traitor we were looking for. It was the only way, Barbara. He's a traitor to you. The revolution isn't all bad. Neither are the people who support it. Well, he got what he deserved. You check your history books before you decide what people deserve. Huh. That was a good scene. Gone. He's just knocking out everyone. Oh. Betrayed me, citizen. Lock 
her away. I must insist that you re release that young child immediately. They're yours, aren't they? Given in exchange for those rather splendid clothes. You know, that's the biggest fairy story I've ever heard in my life. I could have <laughs> had you arrested any time I wanted. Because I need friends. If you agree to help me, your granddaughter will be released. You will have to take me to his hideout. Never, sir. I refuse. You do not have a choice. Well, there's no sign of your friends. I left the door unlatched. So now anyone can walk in. <laughs> They are. The mate. Your friend has betrayed us. We made a bargain. I had to collect. I am James Sterling. Robespierre sent for me today. There is another plot to depose him. Good. There's an inn called the Sinking Ship on the Calais Road. It'd be ideal for a secret meeting. Right, now we're ready for them. <clears throat> These two are never going to get home, are they? <laughs> Let me take your cloak, citizen. Here we are. How many guests are you expecting? Just the one. I like the rain sound, it's so soothing. Good night, good night. See who it was? No. It's Napoleon. Napoleon Bonaparte. Oh. Robespierre will be arrested after tomorrow's convention meeting. He'll be tried and executed before his friends have time to reorganize in the event of failure. I shall, of course, deny this meeting ever took place. I should be ready to take over. Napoleon, if he gets a foothold to power, one day he will rule France. I'm going after Susan. And join Barbara and wait for the carriage. I'll see you outside the prison. <laughs> this is wrong. <laughs> They're traitors, traitors. I promise to save France. I will promise. Oh. Ah, I'll give you quite the more talk out here. Oh. Well, he's alive. <laughs> Robespierre's finished. They're taking him to the prison. It's up to the doctor now. You came back. I you feel bad for this jailer. <laughs> still have a score to settle with you. Really? Guy's stressed money. out. I will give you the benefit of the doubt. Get out. Thank you, citizen. You won't regret it, I promise you. I hope not. Oh, grandfather. <laughs> there, there. Oh. They've just heard about the downfall of Robespierre. Prisoner for you. Citizen Robespierre. Indeed, and I don't waste your breath on him. <laughs> yes, yes, Susan. I wonder who will emerge as the next ruler of France. Remember the name Napoleon Bonaparte. Where do you all come from? Here they are. He's got Susan. I hope they have a pleasant journey. But to where, Jules? I get the impression they don't know where they're heading for. <laughs> to any of us. Suppose we'd written Napoleon a letter. Wouldn't have made any difference. Either. What are we going to see and learn next, Doctor? Our destiny is in the stars. All right, cool. All right, so that is the end of season one. Very good season. First of all, this story really good. I enjoyed it. Setting the French Revolution, cool. Napoleon being in the story, that's cool. Don't really know much about him, but I'm aware of him, so cool. Cool that is here. The animation, it did have some quick cuts, but it did make it more dramatic. Um, so that was cool. The one issue that I do have is that it's kind of hard to tell which character's which. Maybe I'm just not used to it yet. It was hard to tell which character was which with the uh, side characters. But yeah, other than that, I was uh, fine with it. I was fine with the animation. I liked it. But yeah, overall, season one, great. I've enjoyed it. I'd say the Aztecs was my favourite. There was two of them that I didn't like. The Sensorites and... Uh, edge of destruction but the other ones were good i like the other ones as i've said the doctor's really cool eden barbara is really cool i like susan as well but susan's there's not really much to susan yet she's just sort of the uh the doctor's granddaughter and she's just there i feel like there's a lot more going on with ian and barbara than there is with susan she's she's just sort of there but yeah she's cool as well this tardis team really like him really enjoyed it really good season can't wait to watch more Thank <laughs> you.